Good morning everyone. So you are watching Jar Mushroom. So I just want to show you an update sa um, substrate natin na uh, Dayami. So as you can see, nauna na pong lumabas yung pink, yellow, and then we also have white right there. So hindi po sila sabay-sabay kasi hindi rin naman po namin sabay-sabay silang nataniman. So, ganyan po by batch po kasi. Tsaka ang kaya lang po kasi ng drum, pagka 8 by 14 po ang protein bag is nasa 45 pieces. Meron na po naman ako iba dito na harvest na hindi ko na po inantay na mag-mature sila. So, may mga pinheads and like this. Ayan po. Yung mga lumalabas na po mga pinheads dyan. Marami pa po yan. I like this. So, here are the pink Look at that, how gorgeous they are. And we have yellow. So I'll show you. So this kind of thing for newbies na hindi po alam tong ganitong scenario. Uh, this is what you call spores. Ito po. Yan. Spores po yan. Meaning, na late na po ako ng harvest. So matured na siya kapag nagre-release na po siya ng spores. So I have to harvest na yung mga mushroom na yan. Those are the yellow. So these are the pink ones. Beautiful pink. Look at that. Yan po, may mga peanuts na maliit pa lang. Then mga malalaki. The bottom. Madilim na po sa baba. So these are the whites. Yan. I don't know what's causing this. If you know, please comment below kung ano pong cause niyan. Kung butiki po ba ang kumakagat. So, ayan po yung ano. Ito, small pa lang po sila. So, mga tomorrow po po ang harvest niyan. So, marami pa rin po tayong mga um, pinheads na lalabas right there. Kasi, the weather is really good, favorable. It's colder. Laging umuulan. Yan po kasi ang gusto ni Mushroom. So, the best time talaga magtanim is after summer. So, during the summer, naka-incubate yung fruiting bag nyo. Then, nag-start yung rainy season. Dapat timing din po na lalabas yung bunga nung... Alam nyo na one month na siya at mag-fruit na yung fruiting bag nyo. So, that's how you should do it. I mean, hindi ko naman po sinabi huwag kayo mag-mushroom mag, uh, ng summer. So, sometimes you have to schedule or ipaplano po natin. So, meron din po ako sa likod. So, um, ang practice ko po is I usually cut on the side like this. Para po may lumalabas sa harap, may lumalabas sa likod. Mas mabilis po. Kakaunti lang po itong floating bags ko na nakahang. So, I only have two, light, two row. Isa po dito and isa po dito. Dito po kasi, um, Ang nakahang dito, nataniman sila last April 20. So, papuno pa lang po sila. Right there. Pero, tinanggal ko na po yung cotton waste and yung paper. Kasi alam ko malapit na po silang magbunga. Kasi, almost 99%. Ito na lang po hindi na magkakaroon ng... This, this part is wala pang mycelium. So, thank you for watching. So, if ever you need a spawn, the white, pink, yellow, black, gray, brown, milky, uh, wood ear or jelly ears, tengang daga, auricularia, those are the same scientific name. You can message me, private message me. Please subscribe and follow my page. I have a lot more. Marami po akong tips and that will help newbies so watch out for that so thank you for watching bye